Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm very excited to share my whole Louis Vuitton collection with you. So if you want to know all of the Louis Vuitton items that I have, then keep on watching. Alright you guys, so I'm very excited about this video. Give it a thumbs up if you want more collection videos because of course I own other brands as well. But yeah, I am very excited to start off this video and I thought I would rank all of the items. So I will definitely show you my favorite item first and then go all the way to my worst item. I mean, it's not a bad item, uh, otherwise I would have sold it, but I just use it the least. But I still love it nevertheless and I thought I would share with you my favorite item first because honestly I always want to know like what the favorite item is so I don't want you guys to skip all the way to the back but um, yeah watch it chronologically so I'm gonna start off with my first item and to people that know me and know my channel this is no surprise so my favorite Louis Vuitton item is actually my pochette Felicie in the Damier Azure and I feel like it's very weird because this is my only Damier Azure piece and also Damier Azure is probably the least bought canvas of Louis Vuitton like generally and so I think it's kind of weird that this is my favorite but just a couple reasons why this is my favorite first of all I've worn it in the summer time almost exclusively because I think it goes with everything is super versatile and also carefree second of all I love the um, little chain because I think it's gorgeous it just shines in the light and it looks so nice and so just luxurious and then it's a three-in-one so basically this is my first um, item but those are three items because you get the wallet on the chain and then you get this little card holder thing and then also you get the zippy pouch so to me this is just such a good value for money back because you get all of these three items and plus you can also interchange the look of it you can like um, interchange the chain I don't know if I showed you guys this before but I wanted to show you something really quickly because a lot of people actually comment on my very very old video I think it was the second or third video I've ever filmed and it was about this back to how I did it that the chain was shorter you just press the hook through this loop and then so you press it through this loop and then you have it on the other side and then you slide it and hook it on the other hook so you basically have both of your hooks on this side if you can see and no hook on the other side and then it's the perfect length to just wear yeah under your shoulder so I think this is just like a very very nice piece I just wanted to show you that trick because I don't think a lot of people actually know about it so I kind of wanted to share but this is definitely my number one favorite piece and let's move on to the next bag in my collection so actually I own four Louis Vuitton bags and this is my second favorite not necessarily because I love the look that much. I love the look, don't get me wrong, but I was contemplating if maybe this would be my first choice because I just use it so much, especially in the winter time. But this is my work bag. So this is my Louis Vuitton Neo Noé. I have it in the monogram with the black leather accents. And this is just the best bag. Like I use it for going uh, around like running errands. I use it as a work bag. I use it, yeah, I, I used it uh, past tense when we could go out to go shopping or something. So this is just really versatile. You would always, like you would use this bag if you would um, have to carry like a small water bottle and maybe if you wanna put away some groceries and things like that. So I just really love this piece. I have reviews on I think almost every single piece on my channel so I will link everything down below so if you want to know more information then you can click down below my third piece is not a bag but an SLG and also if you know me this comes to no surprise that this is my favorite SLG by Louis Vuitton this is my key pouch and actually this houses my airpods at the moment and has been for um, a couple of months and usually my car key is attached but yeah this is my like I would recommend this highly 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 so if you can get your hands on it 
even stock up on them because they get more and more expensive but I love this piece and um, I have an in-depth review of it on what you can actually fit inside or what you can use it for the different yeah just uses you have for this so I will link it down below check it out it's a very good video I really like it so yeah this is my key pouch by Louis Vuitton and this is place three then the next one is one of my or it's it's my newest Louis Vuitton item except like something that I show you afterwards so this is my Nano Speedy in the monogram I really really love this bag I got it for my birthday last year so I'm really obsessed with it I think it's just gorgeous and I'll fit so much I'm so surprised on how much I've been using it and loving it so this is definitely my fourth favorite Louis Vuitton item and also my third favorite bag and then I have another piece that is still in its box and this has a reason and I talked about this in my uh, best and worst luxury purchases video so if you watch that video you know what this item is but I'm gonna unpack it really quickly yeah it comes in its drawer box and I've checked if it's like the right item already because I um, it's been sitting in its box for like a couple of weeks now but yeah it's like a drawer box and then you open it up and you see the dust bag so I have the dust bag right here and you can see it's a semi small item and I got my mini pochette bag so I don't think this is my mini pochette I think this is just um, a new one um, it has stuffing inside well I know that it's not mine because they lost mine but yeah I got a new mini pochette and I still got it for the old price so yeah it was a whole hassle with them losing my mini pochette because I wanted them to get this leather thing replaced because I've only owned the mini pochette for like a couple of weeks and then it looked really gross and it already peeled off and I went into the boutique and wanted to get it repaired and she sent it off to Paris and then they lost it and yeah so I was without my mini pochette for a couple months now and I'm now I got a new one from them because they first they wanted to refund me but I didn't want the refund I just wanted the piece because it's so hard to get and yeah I had to go to Munich to a different city to uh, kind of get my hands on this so yeah that was a whole different thing so I finally have it back and this is my fifth favorite item in this video mainly because I haven't had it for that long it would have probably been way up there with some other pieces but I haven't had it that long to I don't know fully appreciate it I guess so this is a very good item I think this is also a very good collector's item so if you're into Louis Vuitton pieces and if you're into luxury fashion this is an item that is kind of like a must for collectors so yeah this is a really good piece I also have a video on how I would use it and different purposes uh, to use that for so if you want to know some information then just check that out and then we're down to my two last items so um my second to last favorite item is actually my six room key holder so i have all of my keys inside there and i just wanted to share with you and i hope you can like you'll be able to see it but okay so first of all the button you could definitely see that and then like up here it's already really scratched and then the piping is starting to peel off I just hope you can see that I don't know if you can't I will try and insert some pictures but it's kind of bothering me and I know you can get the button replaced and if I decide to do so I will definitely just go for the gold button because I feel like it's much more durable and yeah it just looks better for longer but I'm still kind of disappointed because I only had this product for not even half a year I know like half a year of wear is kind of a lot especially if you use it every day but I mean it's Louis Vuitton and you pay like a 10 times the price that you would pay for no name just really good quality piece so yeah it kind of makes me disappointed but yeah it's okay like I will give it maybe a check if the Louis Vuitton store is open again and ask NSA to look over it and tell me if these are normal signs of use and maybe they can do something about it and now we're off to my last favorite 
item. I don't want to say like it's my least favorite because it's actually my first baby. <laughs> so this is my Danier Abin Louis Vuitton Speedy Bag. I just wish, honestly, um, I, I just wish I would listen to my mom and got the Bandolier version because uh, back then when I got it it was 635 euros guys that was so cheap like and it still looks pristine like I can't see anything wrong with it this bag is just so perfect but I don't use it because I I like to be hands-free and this kind of look is not always something that I like to go through uh, like to go for one or two times I actually took the strap off my neo noe and put it on here and then I put like a little like a twilly to like match the black and that looked really good I can actually do a video on how to like maintain and clean and take care of and also uh, zhuzh up your luxury handbags if you want that but yeah so I um, used it that way but I was in the boutique once and I wanted to buy a strap for this one and she told me that she won't sell the strap to me because if you click it here and on the other side this will pull over time and rip and it's irreparable so yeah that's something that she said and you have to be cautious of that so um i wouldn't recommend doing it but on the other hand i feel like it's really a shame like i just wish i got it like i i'm just wondering maybe if i can get an insert or something i i have an insert in there um as you can see it's the same color it's a gorgeous red color but yeah i don't know like i i don't want to sell it because it's been my first and it's so sentimental to me like i worked my butt off when i was 18 i worked at a shell gas station and i worked after school like on wednesdays after school and then i worked saturday and sunday to be able to afford this bag so it holds a really really special place in my heart and I know like this for me this kind of signalizes hard work pays off because I always wanted this and um, this was so cute back then like when I was 18 that's um, seven years ago this was so in and everybody had it so yeah that's just something that it signalizes for me so I don't want to get rid of it but on the other hand I really wished I got the bandolier version so this was all of my Louis Vuitton items. I really hope you like the rating of these items. Um, would you have rated the items the same order as I have? Leave that down below. And otherwise, I'm really excited that you watched this video. And um, I'm also very thankful for your support. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so down below and also give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you for my next one. Bye guys. <laughs>